paraphrase written by Xavier Pinto and published by Vida Publications. So in this first uh, take 20 to 21 page, then over the act one and scene one, everything we have to be thorough when we are studying English literature. So enter Antonio Salerno and Salanio. So in this scene one, Quenra there that we are known by it and where the scene is taking place in a street in venice okay so first antonio says in suit i know know why i'm so sad it means that truly i do not know why i feel so sad and next saying that it varies me you say it varies you the feeling makes me depressed and you say that it makes you depressed too each line by line the meanings are to by line. next but how i caught it found it or came by it where i had the feeling from found it or got it and what it consists of and how it originated i have yet to know he's saying that what stuff this made of whereof it is but i am to learn he's saying that with these lines and the depression makes me such a dull fellow that failed to know who i am that is, and such a one with sadness makes of me that I have much ado to know myself. And those in suit means truly, as I said, in suit means truly. That's important in this line. Like this, uh, Antonius, this line says us that uh, he says that he have a sadness, but he don't know from where it has come or from where it had originated or nothing. He's like yet to learn it next Salanio says uh, that as we know that three persons are Antonio, Salarino and Salani. the Salarino is gonna say your mind is tossing on the ocean it means that your mind is at the sea then there where your Argos is with police sail that means that there your ships full with cargo move on the waves like signals and rich burgers on the forest like great lords and wealthy citizens the large ships pass in a magnificent position and rule over the small ships that is or as it were the pagans of the sea do overbear the petty traffickers and then it is saying that, that courtesy to them do them ruins as they fly by them with their woven wings it means that the small ships bow before the big ships as they speed past them with their canvas canvas sails means that that uh, that usually appear as the wings then Salanio is saying that believe me sir I had I such venture forth that means that believe me sir if I had such like like that were financial ventures in danger then he's saying that the better part of my affections that is the greater part of my talks be with my hopes abroad I should be still plugging the grass to know where sits the weight so that is that he is saying that the greater part of my thoughts would be fixed on my hopes abroad. I would then be pl plucking the grass and throwing it up to see in which direction the wind is blowing. He is saying that I would also study the maps, harbors and channels and consider everything that might pose danger to my business. This certainly would make me sad. He says that peering in maps for ports and piers and roads and every object that might make me fear misfortune to my vengeance out of doubt would make me sad. That's what I said. Next, Salarno said, my wind cooling my broth means that when I blow upon my soup to make it cold, I tremble with fever. That is a bit blow me to an ague when I thought, what a harm, wind too great at sea might do, I should not see the sandy hard glass run. But I should think of shallows and of flats and see my wealthy Andrew dropped in sea. Means that when I blow up on my soup to make it cold, I tremble the fever to think of a damage a strong wind might do on the sea. He, seen, he thinks that the sight of sand running out from the hover glass makes him think of danger of shallow waters and sands. This makes me imagine that my lotus ship is grounded in sand. Till here, okay. <coughs>